Hi everyone, welcome. This is Stardust LV and today we're gonna do a one year wear and tear of this beautiful bum bag. I'm also gonna show you the organizer that I got for this and why did I get it. So let's get started. So let's look if there's a wear on this bag. This is what it looks like on top. The vachette has turned into a honey patina color and I am glad that it darkens evenly and also at the back as you've noticed the the strap has softened and it also has a even honey patina which I am glad so I admit I sprayed this with Colonial Carbon Pro when I got it just to make sure that if I will spill water on it it will not stick as easily compared to not spraying it i have a story to tell guys so i brought this one time we went for a cave exploration here in our state and i didn't know that bags are not allowed inside they made me leave the bag in the car and it was so hot i think it's more than 100 degrees so I left this at the car, like we toured the cave for more than an hour. And as, I, as we were touring, I was thinking of this purse. I'm like, what will happen with this purse under the heat of the sun? And I, I'm really worried that I left this in the car. And when we're done, I check it out and this vachette has softened. Like it's really, really soft and also the one here on top it is so soft that i'm thinking that i hope it will still be firm in time and this one is still okay but the the strap is really soft and now it also has its advantages it's easy for the strap to cling on my body if i'm gonna use it and because of the sunlight in the car it has darkened more and I am glad that it turned to be uniform patina all around it so this is adjustable you can adjust it here or you can also adjust it here on the other side and this is such a cool bag guys it is nice that it is close to the body so it's easy to get in and out and as you can see it's still in amazing amazing condition the gold hardware still looks excellent and i cannot see any scratch in this if it has it is very very faint to the naked eye and this one also is in beautiful honey patina color and inside it looks like this and at the back I usually put my phone here at the back for easy access and it has a, a textile black lining and when you open this you're gonna see also black lining and it doesn't have any slip pockets inside the one that I got is made in France and it is just one big base inside and it still looks clean when I got this I'm thinking that I don't need an organizer as I like the soft shape that it has and I like that it clings more to the body with the canvas being soft but during storage I saw that it doesn't really keep the shape like it doesn't keep the shape because of the soft canvas that it has so I decided to buy this Zumuni organizer again guys this is not sponsored I'm just sharing to you how I used why it. I bought this it's mainly for storage and also I've learned how to put this inside when I use this bag as well so this one came in this like a crescent shape to match the shape of the bag and it has a slip pocket here at the back and also three slip pockets here in front and I got the black color I, I like that it just camouflage on the lining of the bag 
because when you open this you can really see what's inside and it's nice that it's uniform to the color here on top so it looks like this if it has a organizer and you see guys when you store it it just maintain the shape of the purse that's why i decided to get it and if you are curious what fits inside let's try to put things again inside with the organizer and let's try to put this mini pochette and this recto verse wallet chanel mini okay so it is really spacious inside and let's try to put this lotion and this chanel lotion so you have two lotion here a back compact a YSL and an Hermes Bastia here on top and this long champ okay I think that's it let's close it so it does fit a lot and I can still fit a cell phone here at the back this is my iPhone iPhone 10 case and it does fit everything just fit inside this purse and again let's try to remove it so i have this ysl hermes bastia and a long champ point purse uh, a compact two lotion okay and also this chanel mini o case recto verso wallet mini pochette so everything everything fits inside this bum bag so it is nice that you can bring your kitchen sink in this bum bag and there's no much wear that I can see guys as you can see it still looks in an amazing amazing shape even though I left this bag in the car for more than an hour in a very hot climate so the stitching are still intact and it still looks in excellent excellent condition it, i love that i can wear this many ways i usually put this in front of my my chest if i'm just walking around however if i'm in the store and let's say i'm looking for stuff especially clothes if i'm looking at the rack i don't want this in front of me i usually turn it like this so i have like space here in front and try to do what i do in the store and then i just put it back like this if i'm walking around so i can just get my wallet easily if i need to get my wallet so supposing i'm gonna put this wallet in and lotion inside and my sunglasses so if you are if trying, you are trying to get your stuff inside sometimes I just slide this zipper easily or sometimes I flip this up it depends but it's it's just easy to open and close it like so I made a video on this why I love this bum bag and I'm gonna link it in the description down below that was last year when I got this purse and after a year I still love this bag and a lot of people are saying that this is a trendy piece that's why they shy away from buying a bum bag but it's still in the craze and people are still buying this particular bum bag now it has a world tour and you can also see in other in other Louis Vuitton patterns that they also incorporate the bum bag look I guess this trend is here to stay bum bag has been in use way 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 back and it's still one of the most practical purses that we have and right now there's a lot of ways to wear a bum bag you can wear it in your front or at the back or here in your chest or at the back of your chest or or some also wear it like this or, or they put it here on the arm and turn it like this I do, sometimes I do this but mostly I wear it here in front for easy access because I like if I can access my purse right away or my sunglasses 
this rectal versal wallet really matches this monogram bum bag in my opinion like it really looks good together and it just makes me happy that each time i get this here from my bum bag like it matches and i also have this monogram belt and it's um i think i got this from man's so it has a bigger buckle and it's also monogram but having this all together is just okay it looks it looks good and you can pair this up and i also pair this with the mule sandals and yeah you can never get away with mono even if there's a lot but it just looks perfect together i can still say that i recommend this bum bag for practicality and it looks pretty on and it never goes out of style and it's just so easy to use it fits a lot as well so it's functional pretty and it fits way 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 more than you can imagine thank you so much for watching let me know about your thoughts on the bum bag if you have one and if you love it or or if you don't like it i just want to hear your thoughts on this bag i appreciated all your comments and thank you so much for watching may all of you have a wonderful day and stay safe everyone please do like and subscribe so i'll see you on my next video bye